Hi everyone, this is Mistel and I'm here today to show you how to beat Farmer Nishi after f patch 5.4. And there's a lot of people I've seen complain about uh, having issues beating this particular pet afterwards with two pets uh, because of the buffs to um, the siren here and um, also the fix of um, of weather effects. So basically before the siren would uh, would not cast um, the solar beam which meant that you would basically have a free pass if you had enough damage to take this one out but now can deal quite a lot of damage so uh, so yeah it's a little bit tougher um, I'm basically if, if you're not familiar with how why you would want to beat this particular farmer every um, every reset or every day it's because it's really really good to help level your low level pets up because it gives a lot of uh, XP especially if you have one of the treats and now before I would just go with uh, any aquatic pet but after this buff um, I'm basically going with the mirror strider here because it can change the weather and you really need the weather to change otherwise the uh, solar beam is going to do a lot of extra damage and it doesn't hurt that it heals a little bit either because it helps keep your um, low level pet alive so the other reason to use the mirror strider is because of the pump ability and the pump ability will basically if you're lucky one shot siren if you're not lucky like there it will at least do a lot of damage and you can finish off with the water jet also um, the mirror strider is fast which means that you get extra attacks in on siren so there you have it that's how you take down siren really easily now here again um, I'm fast and he's going to do the the root the sons of root so I want to get an attack in before he do does that and then while he's doing the root I can do a heal with the uh, cleansing rain and then I can start pumping so when he comes up I'll be ready to uh, to blast him with some some damage here. So I'm taking a little bit of damage, I'm pumping, he will do the final round of damage and then he'll resurface and I'll shoot him. And you can see now he's at very low health. Should be able to take him out with the water jet. There we go. And then basically it's just um, a matter of taking out brood of Mortalis and you probably have a good way of doing that from before. Uh, I used to use um, I used to use, sorry, I'll just check this. I used to use my uh, Grundy here because he's humanoid but with mechanical um, attacks which is strong against this guy but for this video today I figured I would just um, show you how to use the a pet that is hopefully available to more people and um, the Dark Moon Steppel in here. So with this guy you want to use the decoy ability because it means you'll take less damage and then you just basically blast. So you put in bombing run and then you just blast with the missile and you can see I'm blocking his attacks now it's really good if you can time it with his uh, dive ability but it's also good if you can just basically avoid um, well any damage really so I was a little bit silly there putting the bombing run in so it would hit him while underground but we're gonna get him down now with a missile uh, with um, a bombing run there so there you have it, that's a great way of leveling up your s lower level pets. If you haven't done this in the past, then now you know how to do it. You can see I got a lot of levels there, I think that was 7 levels. And if you have had issues with it, uh, with this fight since um, the buff with 5.4, the buff to Siren and to um, Toothbreaker since 5.4, then hopefully this will have helped you figure out how to uh, do the fight again so you can get those pets up for the Celestial Tournament. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe and if you have any ideas or uh, comments, then leave it in the comment section below. Also, I have just started a website or a blog that uh, is 
helping backing up these videos with some more information and ideas, strategies, etc., etc. for pet battles. So if you're interested, make sure that you check it out. I will leave the link in the description field below so you can find it. Anyway, until next time, bye bye.